This is MTP Flyers here with another review. This is my Spec Aft Pack that I got for my birthday. I have been using this nonstop for the past two weeks since I got it. Taking it to work, taking it to school. It's been a huge help. I'm not forgetting as many things as I used to. And it's very comfortable. It keeps everything organized. So I've always wanted a bag. I was just always looking for the perfect bag. All right, let's bag. go ahead and get this thing started. First things first, we have the front pouch here. And what this basically is for are your accessories. Held on by this clip, which can be adjusted depending on what you have in there. It actually does allow for some room if you need to overload that. You can see in there that actually does open up quite a bit. And as you heard when I grabbed this, it actually has Velcro across the entire bottom here. However, there's only Velcro on the corner here and the corner there. So it does give you a little bit of room to do what you need to do, move that around. Why they didn't put Velcro across, I don't know. You know, it works for me so far. So what we got here to start is your first pouch. What I usually keep in here is sometimes my wallet, but I will keep my keys in there. See, the, the clip is already off. I have that on my keys. I throw that in there. The pouch is nice and deep. Not very wide, but it does do the job that you're looking for as far as the pouch goes. So you see in there, it gives you the room that you need. It's very, very nice. Holds enough for the keys. I have a lot of keys on my keychain, so it does push it out a little bit. And there's not much more that I keep in there other than that. But in here, I actually keep an extra pen and my markers just in case. It has the Velcro there and the Velcro down there, which is nice. And same thing for this side and you'd be surprised how deep the pouch is and actually what I have in here right now is my 4G. I take that to work and actually it was a huge help today because I left my Sirius radio in my other pocket in my jacket which I should have left it in here but I had this I could listen to music so I didn't have to kill my iPhone and I had that in there so that was perfect I hooked that up to my speakers but as I was saying this goes down pretty pretty darn far that's all the way up to my hand, and you know, I got fat fingers, so I can't necessarily get that all the way down there. But that does go pretty deep. On the side here, which I have used a couple times already, you can open that up for a water bottle. So that's actually very nice, and you can put it away. So, I've used that a couple times. Very nice. The main pocket here, this is where I keep my camcorder, and this very camcorder that I'm using. It's very soft in here. I don't bother using one of those bags. It keeps everything in here just fine. And in here, actually, make sure I didn't forget it next time. My Sirius Satellite Radio. I love this thing. And I actually keep my cords in here. I have my hard drive, which I'm starting to use as extra backup on my MacBook because I've managed to fill that up. It's a not a very thick pouch down there, but it does the job. And we'll move the lighting here so you can see what's going on in there and show you guys exactly what the deal is. So there you go. What we have in here is your main section of the bag and if you'll... there we go. I actually have a lot of stuff in here from class. So I had a lot of stuff in there so that's that's pretty well pretty well stockable for books that you need. I have my air drives that I reviewed and I absolutely love. I keep them in there. And that's a nice little pouch for your headphones. And there's a pouch back here for your iPhone or your MP3 player or whatever you use. And the reason why that's there is because at the top here, you actually have a little port to stick your headphones through. If you want to carry this and have your headphones on inside the bag, put that on your back wires come out right behind your ear. The most important part of all this is where the laptop goes behind it. And I am going to tilt this up just a little bit. I'm sorry for all the moving guys. Let's go ahead and show you guys. This is all, all cushion, all soft on here on the back. That is really, really nice on there. You guys can see that. And you actually have access through here to get to your laptop as well as, I should have shown you this before I did that, as well as in here. 
So we're going to tilt this down one more time and I want to show you guys exactly the deal. Velcro, access to your MacBook. Very, very soft here all the way down through. Very, very nice. Protects it. Of course, I've got the spec see-through on there, so that's protecting it as well. But if you turn this around and turn your straps around, there's your access so you don't have to open up your entire bag. Slide that out. You're good to go. And you got lots of room in there. It's very, very soft. And like I said, you got a lot of cushion right there. Very, very nice. Protect it. Keep it warm. If I leave it in the car, which I usually don't. So that is very, very nice. And we'll get the laptop out of the way here. So that is the inner workings of the bag. There are just a couple more things I want to show you guys. And that's just little things in the bag. Right here at the really top, cool. there's a handle to carry the bag. Nice and strong, really in there. Well, you notice that there's a zipper next to it. Well, you, you probably guessed it by now. You can actually put this away if you don't want the handle on there and put it away. Look at that. The zippers on this are made of a thick plastic. It won't go anywhere, just like every other zipper on this bag. You got some big zippers there, what you got going on. You do have a lip on there if you want to hook something on there. Deal. Like I said before, the straps are very thick and very comfortable. There is one other aspect to this that I want to show you guys, and that actually is down here. When you're carrying the bag on a trip, they actually have these clamps that you can come across and you can safely secure this to yourself if you're hiking or you're going on a long trip somewhere. That way it can't be taken off you. Very nice. Now, my one knock on the bag. That's nice that you can put them away, but if you notice, and this very well may do it right here, that broke off. I put it back on, and I can't get it to stay. Very bad. I'm not happy about that, because I'm going to tell you, every time I grab the bag, I'm sitting here, I'm catching my finger on this, so I wasn't very happy about that. I'm a little perturbed. All the other zippers are fine. And I noticed the other day, now I'm putting this back in all the way. I'm putting it all the way in. And I think it's just, there's just too much in there. Because this does the same thing. Look, see that? I'm zipping it up. It doesn't zip. It's not grabbing. Now, I don't know about you guys, but for ninety dollars, that should be doing a little bit better. See, I, I and I've played with this a lot. It just doesn't zip up, so now they stay open. So I'm not too happy about that. I don't know if that's a flaw of the zipper itself. I don't have any problem with any of the other zippers, except that right there. Now it does have rubber feet on the bottom. Very nice rubber feet. Very durable. But like I said just kind of falls forward. I even had the weight in there and it still did not stand all that well, but uh, that doesn't really bother me. Someone may be looking at this, may be looking for something like that. I just wanted to point it out to you guys. But this is a good bag, guys. So, that's it. That's the Spec Aft Pack. Check it out at specproducts.com. Spec, this is a great product. I love it. I recommend it. And the only thing I think you need to take a look at are these zippers back here. That makes me a little bit upset. And I barely even use them, you know, so someone that uses it all the time is going to be frustrated at the fact that you're trying to zip that up and it's not working. I've got some real big things coming up. I have been promising you a giveaway for my 200th. We're past 250 right now. So I am going to do something real big this weekend for you guys. So guys, thank you very much. I'm at 269 tonight in subscribers. Thank you very, very much to everybody, and I will talk to you guys later. This is MTP Flyers. Have a good night.